Hey guys, AJ here from Rage Age Brick Arms. Um, I'm here with another video. This one is a review for the XBR4, the wireframe edition. And this is the custom printed weapon specifically for the GI Brick edition. Um, as you can see, this is the GI Brick edition because it's got the green wire, um, specifically only made for GI Brick. Um, they most certainly do make other colors. They make blue, they make red, they make yellow, they make orange, they make a rainbow color, and they make a patriotic color. Um, this gun is very high in detail, as you can see. Um, just by looking at it right off the bat, the uh, wireframe most certainly does give it a um, extra splash of detail. Um, maybe my camera will focus in. I'm not sure, maybe a little bit more of a zoom. Mm, wait, looked like it was working. Nope, okay. Um, that's okay. Today I've got some extra lighting going on here. I've got, um, two more. Lights helping me out because of the shadows that I've got going on. Um, but as you can see here, and I've got a little pointer today. Not very good one, but it's going to work for today. Actually, you know what we're going to use? We're going to use one of my heavy barrels. These heavy barrels are used on M2HBs. Um, the M2HB Signature Edition sign, uh, with the crate signed by Will Chapman was in the previous video. Um, check it out after you watch this one. Um, oh yeah, this works great. So, back here we've got the recoil pad. Um, or as you could also call it, the stock or the butt of the gun. Very nice. Um detail in that much much m much design added uh, right here we've got a nice scope we've got the trigger we've got the handle we've got the uh, the aerodynamics of this gun are very well thought out um, this gun I guess you could call it maybe maybe you could call it this like a uh, futuristic type gun um, you can uh, also make, oh my gosh, I keep moving my, my, uh, th my stage base type thing. Um, you can see we've got the, uh, three battery life part circles. And we've got, um, just, just some more, uh, lines that show where, um, the gun is indented and stuff. So now we're going to take up a real good close-up of the gun. And, uh, I'm going to take one of my lights to help us out here. Um, so this is a nice, um, nice gun. Very nice. Well thought out on, uh, Brick Arms part. Very nice. Um, yeah. So this is a very nice gun. I do like this. This gun, I definitely would give a 10 rating. Um, just because of its um, detail. And that I didn't even have to uh, put any parts together. Putting things together is always an issue. Gosh darn it. Um, for me, just because I don't know why, but it's so complicated for me. So, uh, that's always been a complication. But with this gun, there was no complication. So definitely a straight up 10. Um, do believe that's all for this video. This, um, reviewing for the XBR4 wireframe. Um, thanks for watching. Subscribe to see all of Rage Age Brick Arms videos. Um, 
like this video if you loved it like this video if you liked it and uh i will see you whenever i see you bye guys